How can you tell which lobster has been in the tank the longest versus the shortest amount of time? This is an interesting fact I learned years ago during my internship at Brown Trading Co. They're a seafood distribution business in Portland, Maine. What you'll want to do is look at the antennas on the lobster. Since lobsters in captivity have their claws bound, they can't claw at one another, but they can still bite at each other. As a result, lobsters that have been in the tank longer tend to have their antennas bitten off at least partially, and you might also see some discoloration on their shells or even moss growing on them. New lobsters in the tank, however, tend to have their antennas still intact. This is the start of a new series I'm doing on useful facts on food. So if this was helpful for you, make sure to follow and subscribe for more. Catch you next time.